We are going to create an extension so that when there's no bone meal in here. Ow. Who did that? Oh my gosh. Are you seeing this? This means war. Jeez. Hey guys, Profe Pablo here, Spanish teacher turned Minecraft engineer. Here I am in the world where I am creating a farm for everything. I wanted to show you guys a video on how to make this awesome glowberry farm. It's super simple, bone meal powered. All I have to do is stand here and harvest the berries. And however much bone meal I put in there, that's how many berries get deposited into my chest down here. It's really compact, really easy to use, and we're creating an extension once you run out of bone meal here. The observers get pulled away from each other so that they don't keep repeating over and over when you're not using the farm, therefore avoiding lag like I have in this world. Yeah, a lot of my farms already have that kind of repeater clock going on and they keep running and running and running and it is causing lag in my world and I don't want that for your world. Enough chit chat, let's look at the build. Okay guys, I jumped over here to a creative world to make it easy. Let's start off with a double chest. We're going to place a hopper in the side of the chest, but actually this is the back of the build. Let's make this out of emerald block. Place a block there, there, there. Build that up one more time. Place down a rail on top of the hopper. Place a minecart with hopper right there. We don't want that minecart going anywhere, so we're gonna place glass right here to block it in, and we can still open this chest. And to make that look better, I'm gonna place a couple blocks here and here. Then we get a dispenser, place it back here. And then we're gonna come over here and actually break these blocks. I just use them as kind of placeholders. And we're gonna place a temporary block here, take an observer, face it down, and then dig down a little bit and place an observer facing up, creating a repeater clock. Then we kind of need an arc here, just like this. And we are going to Place the glowberries right here, add bone meal to the back, in the dispenser, and then we could just stand here, oops, and harvest those berries all day long. Well, until the bone meal runs out. Okay, and now that the bone meal has run out, I want this thing to turn off. So I'm going to place a block here, a sticky piston, skipping a block pointing in like that towards this observer. I'm going to place a comparator facing out away from the dispenser. Let's place some redstone right here and then a block on top of that redstone, just like that. Now when this thing has bone meal, that piston will extend starting this clock. And when it runs out of bone meal, it will retract like that. I hope you guys enjoyed this super simple Glowberry Farm build. As always, thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.